Hi Chris, uh, this is James, your trainer. Today I'm going to show you your stability exercises. Uh, we'll go into the core exercises after your warm up and then we'll go into the resistance training. First exercise I'm going to show you in the core exercises is called the single leg lift with chop. You'll begin with your feet facing forward. Your hips will be in a neutral position and your feet will be about hip width apart. So you'll begin, you'll raise one leg off of the ground, maintain proper posture, back straight, bring that ball to the side of your body, bring it up over the head, and chop down across diagonally across your body, keeping your balance, keeping that leg off the ground, maintaining stiff core, you can switch legs, start with that ball down, come back up across the body, back down. That is the single leg lift with chop. The next exercise I'm going to show you is called the floor prong cobra. I'm going to demonstrate the, the repetition and then I'm going to explain what to do. So how to begin this is you keep your chin tucked your feet will be in a plantar flexion position. Your arms will begin out away from your side. Your thumbs will be facing out. You'll squeeze your gluteal muscles and you'll pinch your shoulders. Pinch shoulders, squeeze glutes, raise off the ground. Keep your feet in a plantar, position, plantar flexion position. Hold and slowly return back to the ground. And that is the floor prone cobra. The next exercise is the ball crunch for your core exercises. What you'll do is you'll start with your feet about hip width apart. You'll have them extended out past your knees slightly. You'll lie back bringing those knees over top of your heel, bringing your hips up, having your body in line. You bring your arms up to your shoulders rise up halfway just like doing a half crunch and you'll lie back down slowly and return to the supine position come back up and slowly return to your supine position trying to keep that 90 degree angle with your knee over heel and that is your ball crunch this next core exercise I'm going to show you is the stability ball push up with more of a isometric hold to it and concentration on your core. Uh, what you'll do is you'll take your palms, place it on the top of the ball, starting on your knees, with your palms in, your fingers out, you'll extend one foot behind you, and you'll bring up your hips, and you'll have your feet about hip width apart, your hands should be about shoulder width apart, You'll hold that position by squeezing your glutes and your core, your, your rectus abdominal. You'll come down to do a ball push-up. You'll hold, come back up, hold, come back down. Try to maintain that posture. Come back up and hold. And that is a stability ball push-up. So this exercise in your resistance training is the stability ball dumbbell press. You'll need your stability ball and your dumbbells. You'll begin with the dumbbells in between your legs. What I do is I place one hand on my knee here, keep my core engaged, grab the weight, pull it up to my knee. With this hand, Stable on my leg, grab that, stick that on my knee, I'll roll the ball up my back, I'll kick one weight up, then I'll kick the other up, and I'll finish the roll, bring that ball to the middle of my back, you bring your hips up, your feet should be about hip width apart, with your toes facing in a straight line with your body. 
you'll have your hips up, you bring those weights out, your elbows will be wrapped around the ball, and you'll push up, and then you'll come back down slowly, wrapping those elbows around the stability ball again. You'll engage your gluteus maximus, and you'll push back up, and come back down. To end the exercise, you turn the weights into your chest, walk the weight, the ball back down your back, bring the weights down to your legs, finish walking, take the weight to the floor, take the weight to the floor, and that is the stability ball dumbbell press. This exercise in your resistance training is the Bulgarian split squat with dumbbells. You'll need a platform anywhere from 12 to 18 inches tall depending on how tall you are. You'll also need dumbbells so you can pick and choose your own. You approach your dumbbells, you squat down, bending those leg, those knees, pick up pushing like a squat, keep that back straight when you lift, you place one foot out in front of you, you look behind you, get an idea where that platform is, Kick your leg out behind you, chest out. You want to keep that knee over top of your heel. Keep your feet, keep that foot facing forward. Keep your toes facing forward. You'll squat back down, trying to keep that knee over top of that heel. Come back up, keep that back straight when you lift. Come back up, keep those shoulders pinched. And that is the Bulgarian split squat with dumbbells. This next exercise is a stability ball overhead press. How you'll begin is with your dumbbells in between your legs on the floor. You'll place one hand on your knee. You'll keep your, your back straight. You'll bring that dumbbell up to your knee, rest it. The other one, stabilizing, keep that core straight. Bring it up to your knee to get to Get the dumbbells up to your shoulders, bring your legs in, about shoulder width apart, kick one up, rest that on your shoulder, kick the other one up, rest that one on your shoulder, return your feet, have your toes facing forward, pronate your, your hands, Bye. press up, come down slowly, Bye. keep that core engaged, keep that chest up, keep that back straight. Press up, come back down slowly. Hold, back up, and back down slowly. Keep it, keep, remember to keep your back straight on that ball. The end exercise, rest one weight on your shoulder. Bring it down to your knee. Bring the other one to your knee. Flip it out to the side. Flip it out to the side. And that is your stability bell overhead press. This exercise is a stability ball preach curl. What you'll need is your stability ball and dumbbells. You begin this exercise by going into a prone position on the ball, extending your feet, straight leg out behind you, feet about shoulder width apart. Take your elbows, rest them on the ball. They should be about shoulder width apart. And you'll just raise those dumbbells up. You don't want to go all the way up. You want to keep some tension in your biceps. Slowly, eccentrically contract down, concentrating on that negative. Hold. Come back up. Hold. Isometric at the top. Come back down. Eccentrically concentrating and focusing on that negative again. Hold. Come back up. Hold. Lower slowly, and there we are, your stability ball preacher curl.